Welcome back, everybody, with some more Star Sector. Yep. We have driven. Don't you pursue me. Wow. He didn't find my contraband, <laughs> but I lost five relations. Err. Ah. <sighs> 15 combat readiness, great. Great. I gotta kill both of these, but then, you know, it would have been bad. Thanks for costing us supplies. We have something for you guys. Not these, apparently. 250, that just is really bad. Uh, what was I bringing? These as well as bringing in. 266. 128 grand. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, we're bringing you these too. Selling for 77. I think we bought them for 40. And. Some survey data? Nah, 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 nah. What do you have? That possibly could <laughs> giving up nine thousand bucks for this. Here, have the survey data. Fine. It's not bringing it down. This gamma core is illegal to trade on the open market. Uh, let's put defense. Uh, this are Sabbath doubles. It's not really what I want. I have a lot of weapons. I just don't need. I don't need this mining laser. We need crew. You got crew? 42 crew. These are more expensive than the most expensive place. Crew is cheapest in Path and Pirates territory. Which might be difficult for us to get to. Oh boy, oh boy. But we do need a thousand people. I think I just have to bite the bullet and get these crew. Yeah, we need to get up to 1,500 crew. It's just important. And also, if we're going to be extreme, I may as well just buy this. And buy... I got a ton of supplies. Thirty-two grand. Man, I'll... I'll buy. Hmm. Just buy some crew, too. You know what? It's all contraband. It's just, oh, these are cheap. Ah, <sighs> yeah, we can go and sell all the drugs. <laughs> yeah. Yep. Yep, that is what we're going to do, I believe. Personally, we trick, we trick, try tacky. I know. You need those. 295. That's not bad. There seems to be harvested organ glut. So we're gonna go to Ch Ch Chico Mods Talk in Adst Land. That's where we're gonna go. And okay, we got lots of crew. I need like a boatload of fu fuel. Just more fuel, man. <clears throat> How much are these? 112 here? That's not great. I don't need this many. Where can we sell them? Acadia. Salamanca, Percy and League wants them. We were going to go to Sindria after. Whatever. I'll just sell a bunch of them. Not that many. 50? Yeah. Okay, we'll just sell some of that stuff. There we go. This place needs material because there's shipping disruption. There has been civil unrest and all the bad. All the bad has happened here. 
Um, ah, you need volatiles and Sidria. Well, we're not going to Sidria just yet. We are going to Chitsamatak at land. Okay. Do you have a commander? Oh, you do. Are you steady? You are steady. Oh, congratulations. Sounds good. Take the shuttle down. A tough looking man. Friday, no credits. That's a good name. Do you tell. My price is 9,900 credits. And you'll need to provide 10 marines for this to work clearly. There's a heavy Vanguard class frigate collecting space dust a lightly guarded orbital hangar. And I plan to make... I plan to jack the ship. My original sponsor got cold feet, dirt worm. Got the schematic for the hangar, security codes, guards, schedule, everything. Come along, that's where you come. It's on the up and up. I don't expect active resistance. Oh man, that'd be pretty cool. But I'm going to decline. Because that's... That was actually really loud, too. Oh, okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Pause. Patrolling. Loading ships. We are going to Atslan. Chikamatsak. Yep. Head there immediately before this guy wakes up. So we need some quests for hegemony. That seems to be important. Ooh. There is a quest right there. And also, I need to I need to level up. Uh, what do we need on our ship? Wolfpack Tactics. This will give our destroyers and stuff the ability to fight better. Incoming hostiles burning hard, big ones. Two, count three, no, most too many. High energy read, contact six. Affects all ships with officers, including flagship. Nav rating. Maximum combat rating is for ships. Yeah, that might work. Carrier group, also pretty good. Fighter uplink, also pretty good. Mm. Yeah, officer training is going to be good. Also very good. One more permanent hull mod in the ships. Oh, amazing. Gain, gain non-elite helmets, ship damage control, and combat endurance. All ships without officers. Oh, this is amazing. Energy weapon mastery. Gunnery implants. That's pretty good. Uh, yeah, it's pretty good. Ship repair out of combat. That's salvage. This is just increased capacity for everything. Field modulation, point defense, target analysis, just extra damage. Ballistic mastery. Uh, yeah. What's this? Combat endurance. Helmsmanship is more speed, which is really good. Uh, I think... This blows up bigger ships. This gives us movement. This gives our ship movement. Well, will we be driving the next cruisers? Question. Maybe. At most, once every two story points, single hit hull damage above 500 has the portion above 500 reduced. Oh, once every two seconds. 
extra maneuverability. So right now you're in a destroyer, but you're not going to be destroyed forever. I could just make you tankier. Reduce this flex upkeep for shields. Hardened shields reduces damage taken by shields. This is just reducing damage by shields and 25% generated by active face cloak. Or we can just give us damage. Target analysis. Or ballistic mastery. Two destroyers, two cruisers. It'll help you kill things. But this will make you tank here. Oh man, I cannot decide. Uh, you know what? We'll give you speed. Speed! Alright, let's go. We also have, I think, three ships t to outfit. Which I should outfit. So we'll do it in Chikamaksok with all our money. And then we have to do some quests without upgrading ships or whatever. It's just required. Ludic path sells Chitsamonsok. So there's Ludic path here. What happened? Oh no. <laughs> uh, don't, don't get me, don't get me. Okay, good. Don't mind me. 211, this is awful. Just driving around with harvested organs. organs. Organs? Alright, so you need to sell these here. That's worth 10,000, but I can use that in my colony. Uh, 131 per. Per. Ooh, hello, hypervelocity driver. I would like those. Let's see, does that give us extreme? It does. Oh boy, this is 36 bucks a pop for fuel. Tons of these. Is that lower down? No. 81 per, 40 per, 25 per. It's all really expensive stuff. Yeah, everything's really expensive. Don't have hyper velocity drivers. Because I really want to put these on other ships. Medium ballistics. It's, they're very good. It's does every two seconds it shoots. Yeah, I'll get them later. I will get them later. So we're gonna have extreme problems here. Oh, what's your cost? 43, wow. 43, and we just have like tons of stuff. This gun would be nice. Delivers superior damage over time. This gun would be nice too. It's taking eight cargo space. Oh boy, oh boy. Just driving around with organs. Really gotta dump these. Okay, well, we're here. We're going to refit some ships, the ones we bought. So let's have a look here. I think I want you to have Sabos. Do you have Sabos? You have one. Oh, that's a two Sabo. Gotta knock shields down, it's kind of important. Oh, I have a two Sabo right here. Um, yeah, those are all armor missiles. So sure, we'll give you two Sabo rounds. And then we'll give you just like guns, range 700. Anti-shield guns. Why is this eight? Accuracy perfect railgun. 
Yeah. Iron Pulse. Five at a range. Want to stick around 70. Accuracy good, very fast. This is anti armor. Accuracy medium. Okay, you shoot just tons of tons of shots. Dual auto cannons, very poor. Turn rate excellent and poor. Okay. So Vulcans for point defense. Oh, PP lasers, actually. PD lasers, please. Falcons for back. Sierra running. It's a small hybrid. It's a small hybrid. So this is like the best I could do. Just anti-shield things. And then go fast. And reinforce bulkheads in case you blow up. And... Could fit. You could fit. Fit is the overall. Could. Hardened shields. I feel like would be pretty good. Uh, no. Let's 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 go weapon groups. Do this. Two seventies. What you need. Okay. That's it. That's the ship. That's the build. That's what we're doing. Huh, now for you. You got two medium ballistics. What's good for ballistics? Heavy autocannon. Followed by... A thumper? How far does this shoot? 800? Okay. Universal small hard point. Probably... Probably PDs. Front facing PDs. Perfect aim, excellent accuracy. That's burst PD. It's a mining laser. I have a single burst PD here. Max charges, charges per second, charges gained. Sure. And you also need reinforced bulkheads and speed. Um, then I'm thinking maybe hardened shields too. Just to make you a little beefier. Go back, weapon groups. 214, you're already there. So you're there. Might make sense to give you shields as well. I'll have to dump vets though. Alright, now the big guy. Medium at missile. Well. <laughs> This is pressure. Mm-hmm. What else do I got? Double save out, no good. Long range sport. This is a finisher. Yeah. Well, I think anti armor, anti engine. I think we do these ones. Annihilator rockets. Medium energy. Graviton beam? Sure. Small hybrid turret. It's only five out of range. It's not great. Light auto cannon, not great. 
Mining laser. None of these are great. Light dual auto cannon? Just a single auto cannon. Or an assault gun. How about an assault gun? Small energy. IR pulse. IR pulse. And then. I guess burst PD, because that's all we got. And you, sir, this ship isn't very good, I don't think. You need... Unstable injector, you need... Reinforced bulkheads. Huh. Advanced charge arrows? No, not really. Probably just... Like a bunch of capacitor. That's gonna be you. So I'm quickly with the fleet here. Um, gonna put you there. You there, you there. You, 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 you. You go up. Destroy your. Everybody move down one. I believe you don't have a gun. Nope. You don't have a gun. Nope. But you have a gun. And you have a gun. You have a thumper. You don't. You have a fucking cannon assault gun. Okay. So this guy is not very great. He does something. And I guess for my... Uh, for this guy here... I guess, um, I don't think these two Kinev Bombers are doing much. I mean, they have burst PD lasers. So I don't know why they're not doing much. And you shoot torpedoes. Proximity charges. Huh. These are low techs. These are Piranha Bombers, standard Bombay. Could run these things. Uh, midline. These are low techs. This only shoots two out. Ion Cannon, Dual Light Machine Gun, Swarm. It's a fighter. Yeah, I mean, Dagger Torpedo Bombers should be pretty good. These are high-tech bombers. They just don't do good work. Uh, you know what? This is a problem. What, so what's it going to cost her? So it's 100,000 bucks. Wow. You should probably have... Instead of that, you should have another Vulcan cannon. And these harpoons should be super long range somethings. Anti engine, sabos. Uh, I'm thinking you need an unstable injector. Why is that red? Okay. Can I get unstable? No, I can't. I have to get rid of the efficiency overhaul to get rid of unstable injector. I mean, this ship is super damaged. It really shouldn't be fighting much. You can need reinforced bulkheads. 
So maybe, maybe we do put the broad swords in. Yeah. Because you need reinforced bulkheads. But you also need unstable ejector. So I'll just put the reinforced bulkheads in. And then add two capacitor. Uh, this thing's got a lot of demods. You have one point left? Use it. Okay. So we go to the fleet and we go and we find our new guy. Our new steady shield guy. And you are good. Oh, what's this mental button do? Requires a story boat. Increases their experience gain, giving them a wide range of skills to choose from, as well as the opportunity influencing their personality. Oh. So what if I mentor this guy? Uh. Your influence can also cause them to be more cautious or aggressive. Aggressive to a fault, often disregarding safety. Prefer to engage at ranges that allow all of the ship's weapons to provide civilian ships when they... If they were combat ships and will employ any fighters under command aggressively. Yeah, we take our aggressive guy and we try and make him... Or he's reckless, we try and make him aggressive. Right? Sure. He's aggressive now. What about you? You're steady. Steady's good. I want steady. I want everyone to be steady. Except for this guy. <laughs> He's the only one I don't want to be steady. He already blew up a great ship. Um, oh, he also has a level up. So we'll give him that. And I would like to give him... Uh, maximum damage reduction by armor increased from 85 to 90%. Other 50% of the armor damage reduction calculation only based on current heart and flux level. Flux dissipation per ordnance spent on weapons. Ballistic mastery. Probably field modulation. Full damage bonus is 600 range and below. No damage at 1,000 range and above. And I'll give him field modulation. Da -da -da. He leveled. Good job, man. This guy's running fast. He needs damage, damage control, though. And you are steady. You have point defense. No, I can't do much. Okay, they all have monthly salaries. All right, cool. That's that. We did it. Uh, where are we going? I forget. Uh, we just went to Asland. We were going to Asconia. I believe we were going to Asconia. <laughs> Airlift recover deliver via oh we're going to Arcadia. That's where we're going. We can't smuggle these har harvested organs because we can't get into Salamanca at all. So yep. Good job, team. Oh no, we're being tracked. He's gonna hit his gas button. Hitting his gas button. <gasps> He's hitting it. Go faster. We made it. Uh, yeah, pirates got mad. Gained experience from profitable trades. That's amazing. And look at us. Hegemony have regained attack. They have marines. Going to Eventide. 
That's a huge salvage fleet. Wow. Oh, the timer. All right. I'll see you folks in the next episode. Once we go and we deliver this VIP. Bye. There's fighting going on. <laughs>